hello you are welcome how to solve this nice algebra problem solution from here from what we have here to multiply this directly 3 times 3 here same thing as 3 squared then over k times k here same thing as k squared then equals to also from here k times k we have k squared then over 3 times 3 that's also 3 squared which implies from here we can cross multiply 3 squared times 3 squared here then also equals to k squared times k squared from here that is from here this is also we can write this as 3 squared then all squared because it multiplied itself then equals to also k squared also squared from here and from the law of indices when we have a raised to power m raised to power n this is same thing as a raised to power m times n so this power multiplies and we have 3 raised to power 4 equals to k raised to power 4 and here let's bring everything to one side we can take 3 raised to power 4 there and therefore we have k raised to power 4 minus 3 raised to the power 4 equals to 0 now that is here this can be written as k square then all square minus also here we write this as 3 square all squared okay equals to 0 from here that is here this follows this value as 2 square when we have a square minus b square this is equals to a plus b into bracket open bracket a minus b that is here a is standing as k square and b stand as 3 square which implies here this follows this and we have k square plus 3 square into bracket then open bracket k square minus 3 squared close bracket equals to 0 from here that is here we have two possible cases that is k square plus 3 squared equals to 0 or we have k squared minus 3 squared equals to 0 from here and solving this here this follows when we have a square plus b squared which we can write as a plus b i multiplied by a minus b i that is here we can rewrite this as k plus 3 high into brackets then open bracket k minus 3 high now equals to 0 here also we have two cases k plus 3 high equals to 0 or we have k minus 3 high equals to 0 which implies that here we have k equals to minus 3 high and here we have k equals to 3 high so here we have two complex solutions from here and also solving on this side we apply when we have a square minus b square which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket the open bracket a minus b that is here yeah, this becomes k plus 3 into bracket open bracket k minus 3 then equals to 0 from here and also here we have two cases which are k plus 3 equals to 0 or we have k minus 3 equals to 0 that is here k equals to minus 3 and here k equals to 3 also here we have two solutions which are real solutions from here then all together we have four solutions and we can write it out as k1 equals to 3 and k2 equals to minus 3 k3 
equals to 3 hi and k4 equals to 0 0.03 hi so here we have four solutions two free solutions and two complex solutions now let's check if this satisfies the given problem we substitute the first value of k here then what we have here becomes 3 over k that's 3 over 3 times 3 over 3 is equals to here also we have 3 over 3 times 3 over 3 and here 3 over 3 that's 1 times also 3 over 3 that's 1 is equals to also here we have 1 times 1 and here 1 times 1 is 1 which is equals to also 1 times 1 1 left hand side equals to the right hand side so here we have k equals to 3 satisfy the given problem then also for the second value of k which is minus 3 we substitute here and we have 3 over minus 3 times also 3 over minus 3 is equals to minus 3 over 3 times minus 3 over 3 and here this same thing as minus 1 then times here also 3 over minus 3 minus 1 is equals to here also this gives us minus 1 times minus 1 and minus times minus is plus so here we have plus 1 and which is equals to also this side we have plus 1 left hand side also equals to the right hand side then k equals to minus 3 also satisfied the given problem now for the third value of k which is 3 high then what we have becomes 3 over 3 high times 3 over 3 high is equals to 3 high over 3 times 3 high over 3 and here this is same thing as 1 over high here then times also here we have 1 over high because 3 cancel each other is equals to here we have i times i here then 1 times 1 that's 1 i times i that's i square is equals to here on this side i square and we should note that root minus 1 is equals to high and when we square both sides it means i square will now be equals to minus 1 which implies that here we have 1 over minus 1 is equals to minus 1 and of course 1 over minus 1 here is minus 1 which is equals to minus 1 which implies that also k equals to 3 high satisfy the given problem then for the fourth value of k which is minus 3 high then what we have also becomes 3 over minus 3 high times 3 over minus 3 high is equals to minus 3 high over 3 times minus 3 high over 3 then here we can write this as 1 over minus i times also 1 over minus i is equals to here we have minus i times minus i then 1 times 1 is 1 up here and minus i times minus i will still be i square then equals to is equals to also here this gives us i square that is here we have 1 over i square that's minus 1 is equals to minus 1 1 over minus 1 is minus 1 which is equals to minus 1 left hand side also equals to right hand side and k equals to 3 high minus 3 i also satisfy and thank you for watching don't forget the steps subscribe for more videos turn the notification bell share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comment see you next class and bye for now